Whether you have a blank or a responsive project, the default film strip size is 1024 by 627. So let's say you want to increase or decrease the default uh, canvas size right over here. In order to do that, you can go to modify and then go to rescale project. Right now you can see it's 1024 by 627. So let's say you want to reduce it out to some uh, something around 800 by, six to, by 600 right over here. So let's just do 800 by 600 and then press finish right over here and I'm going to press OK, you can see that the canvas resizes itself right over here into 800 by 600 right over here. You can also increase the size right over here. So I'm just going to go around here on to modify rescale project right here. So let's say I want more like an SD resolution that is 1920 by 1080 right over here. You can also see the percentage difference uh, right over here. So 240 by 180 as you can see. So once you press finish and OK, uh, the resolution actually changes out. So let me just go over here, uh, right over here, 1920 by 1080, right over here. And this is the resolution you are working upon now. So you can pull this out, as you can see, and it'll go all the way up till 1920, right over here. But uh, my, my screen cannot fit, that is this area cannot fit all of the resolution, so I can just zoom out right over here. So I'm just going to go to view and zoom out right over here, just like this, and you'll be able to see all of the resolution right over here. So you got right, right around here, 1920, and it goes all the way till 1080 right over here. Uh, from this side as well. So you can see right over here, this is how everything actually looks like right over here. Another thing is over here in static project as well, you can actually go over here and uh, rescale the project. You have more option over here as well as you can see because this is static project. So let's say I want 1920 by 10, 1080 uh, right over here. I don't want to maintain aspect ratio, I can do this. But if I were to maintain aspect ratio, what happens is that let's say I have 200 pixel size right over here, 200 by 200, which makes it an exact square. If I were to maintain the aspect ratio now, you'll be able to see that the other parts increase and changes accordingly as well. Usually I like to enter everything manually right over here. So I'm just going to say 1920 by 1080 right over here. So you can also uh, go for this one and apply this. You can finish and apply this out. You can see that the canvas size has changed entirely right over here. But besides that, what you can also do is you can use the preset sizes over here, like desktop, like go, you can go for like this one and so forth according to what you like. You can just select the preset size as well. And over here, here you have like rescale project to fit the new size. So it will rescale the entire project components and everything to uh, rescale uh, the entire project for you. So this is a handy feature to have it turned on right over here. You don't want to crop it because like it will actually just remove out the information right over there. So you can just go around uh, with the settings of your choice right over here, press finish and it'll rescale everything for you as you can see right here. So that's the title. So you can just drag it out right over here because we just uh, decrease the size. So you can just resize this out and arrange everything out right over here. So this is how you can resize uh, the project and rescale the project inside of Adobe Captivate. So hope you guys learn something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share and subscribe.